I'm John. Hi, I'm Brooke. And we're here to talk to you today not about oranges, but it does start with a C. Wait. Well, but. if we go concrete, that is translucent. The use is for. And, and oranges have vitamin C in them. So it starts with a C. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> a little far, far stretched. But. At least I made the connection. Mm -hmm. Good job. So, question was why would we use translucent concrete? So, I'll, I'm going to have another orange, and Brooke is going to give you some reasons why. Well, I'm trying to come up with some. And see, that's the important thing. If we come up with a new technology and we can't think of a reason why we should have the new technology, then maybe we shouldn't waste the time. We, we should start with the reason why mm. before So why translucent the concrete? I don't I'm trying to think of, like, benefits for maybe sidewalks, but I can't think of why that would be great. Wildlife, maybe? Like, you could see insects? Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> see the little worms digging through her pad? Yeah. There's a reason why you don't eat during uh, filming. I, funny. I'm not sure that would be reason enough to develop it, though, right? Right. So the great thing Fun, is, is that Fun we idea. didn't come up with the reason to develop it. The reason to develop it was already come up with by someone? There's a better way of saying that sentence. Came up with? Came Somebody up already with. came up with it before we ever did it. Um, the first ever use of translucent concrete that I know of was by a 27-year-old Swedish engineer. can't remember his name, but he developed a company called Litricon, where the idea was to take the ugly out of concrete, mm -hmm. to allow light and color to pass through. Oh, very nice. These precast pre bricks and these different, you know, I guess now they make jewelry, but different precast elements that light and color passes through. So the concept is is more architectural. Sure. To, to get to and take the nice. ugly out of concrete, well, the gray and and I guess like if you were in if you built um, a business mm -hmm. building with it, mm -hmm. it would be kind of cool to have mm -hmm. walls that are not you know not totally transparent, but like Hence, yeah, the architecture. It's a nice idea. Mm. Uh, there's always uh, also been folks who have made concrete TVs. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. I don't think so. Yeah, seriously. I mean, I believe you, but I just don't get the reasoning. Um, then there's jewelry. I think I might have mentioned like that already. Like a TV case? No, like, well, like a screen almost. Like, they would project it onto this. Ah, oh, I see. Okay. Projection screen. Yeah. Um, and then, because, you know, the concept of a fiber optic is, you know, you have this strand, and no matter what direction you make the strand, is the light will go from one end to the other. Mm -hmm. So if you have all your strands that go out to your TV, you can have your projection point here, sure. and it goes out to your... Mm -hmm. But that's not the same as translucent. That would be translucent. It would be? Yeah, because you you're could... putting those fibers in the concrete. Oh, you do? Oh, I didn't know Just that. Just like we're going to be doing over there. Didn't know that. So you could use it on sidewalks, it wakes, sidewalks, uh, or... Uh, concrete countertops. Which we're going to be doing. And well, we're we, going to be... We did. We did already make the countertop. Well, but, do you want to yeah. go grab that piece? Sure. And we're going to put this piece here. Well, Brooke can explain it. Okay. So we did the ahead, bar model, Brooke. our logo, and... We are going to, I'm not quite sure exactly how it's going to work actually. We have a hole in the countertop that we're going to be putting this in with light underneath of it, right? So, like, so all the strands are going to come together. Let's see if I can get all this together. We'll collect them all here and either put them in one group or multiple groups but have light going through, you know, over it. And then through the top over here, about this much thickness, uh, we're going to inject some uh, flowable grout, a glow-in-the-dark grout, so it'll surround all these. So uh, when we light it up, you'll see our logo through it, but when you shut the light off, it'll the glow. will be dark? No, it'll glow from where the strands were. Mm -hmm. Well, if it's glow-in-the-dark concrete, though, it'll glow all around it. Mm -hmm. Well, not all around it, because it'll be, you know, this thickness. Sure. And you'll have... You know, concrete in between that's not lit up. Still unclear. <laughs> not translucent. Yeah, it's not translucent. I don't get that. 
So what's the, with the lid? Are we cutting that? Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna okay. cut this off. This is just used as a stencil. Okay. So this is gonna hold it taut, so we get this shape I out see. of it. That's why these were sewn through. So we drilled all these holes up top. <laughs> Unclear. <laughs> we drilled, and then we sewed these optical fibers through, and then hot glued them. So and now when we pull place, them sure. taut, it it'll should be the, the shape of our okay. Movement. Okay. Neat. I'm excited. Still don't feel like... Stay tuned. And I think we... So what's the definition of the word translucent? I think that's the problem. I think we're confused. Clear-ish? No. Translucent. I think allows it's... Allows light allow to pass Yeah, through. I think that's what it means. Mm, Trans... Okay. Like, allows mm. passage. Um, allowing light. light, but not... Detailed shapes to pass through, semi-transparent. Mm -hmm. So we allow light to pass through. Mm -hmm. So there are folks who are using this in driveways for prettiness. Um, I, I guess you could use it for some safety aspects. That's a bit of a freaking stretch. It's more, you know, architectural. Yeah. Okay, so hey, hopefully answer your question. Let us know if you have any more. We've got some videos on how to make translucent concrete. Um, Haley will put those down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Ding that bell for notifications. Go concrete! Beat asphalt!